Let's pray. Uh, thank you, God, for giving us this time for our parents so we can raise our kids with the gospel only, so they can be the future generations within this evidences only. Thank you, God, and we pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. So I'll try to be shorter and shorter every parent's message. So today's parent message will be uh, Deuteronomy chapter 34, 9 to 10. We heard this today. So Moses blessed Joshua. Right, where's Joshua? Oh, he's left. So, so Moses blessed Joshua. And what happened to Joshua? It says, the wisdom of the Spirit came fully through Joshua. In other words, when, when Moses blessed Joshua, Joshua received the blessing of the filling of the Holy Spirit. And you know, after that, what happened is that all Israel obeyed him, what he commanded. So that's very difficult, right? Isaiah. Right. Hey, look at me, guys. Okay, parents look at me only then. Okay, you guys look at each other, but parents look at me. But really, like if you bless them and raise them, to have the filling of the Holy Spirit, let's say I pray for him for the, for the filling of the Holy Spirit, then wherever they go, they will be leaders and spiritual leaders everywhere they go. So that's what we're doing now, every week, every summer school. We want to create them as spiritual leaders, not just any kind of just leader, spiritual leaders. So the key point is what? Filling of the Holy Spirit. So... Today I also want to share a little bit. Uh, in the future, uh, in Friday, I talked about the different colors were like yellow, red, green, and blue world. This I will tell them later. But I will, tell them, I will tell you a little bit about the future works that our kids will be a little bit more ahead. So first, uh, the places that they will work will be always quiet places, quiet places. In other words, my place to work. In other words, 재택근무가 회사는 가지만 재택근무 스타일. So in other words, they will go to the office to work, but they have their own space, place to work. Okay? So if they have a quiet time, they need to know how to meditate. You understand? So everything is more about being alone. That's the future. Second thing. Now, uh, big corporations will be big, but also there will be very smaller corporations. Third, less hierarchy. In other words, there won't be boss anymore. Everybody going together. So if they're not able to go together, in the future they cannot have a, a leader, leadership, correct leadership. So they will have also flexible floor plans. In other words, you need to be flexible. So today you work this time, next day you need to work another time. So they need to be flexible another way. Other thing, they need to work with robots in the future. Okay? So the, not, the other one is smart brainstorming. Smart brainstorming means that they need to know that in every place they'll be able to create things, not just in one place. Okay? So why am I saying this? It's because we need to prepare our kids to be future leaders, but also being flexible, being able to brainstorm in every part they are, and, tr and also being able to work together. So how many? They are? One, two, three, four, five, six. Where is the other one? Oh, seven and, uh, and his brother, seven, right? Seven, eight, and nine. <laughs> and also, if, if, if her, she has two daughters? You have two daughters? Eleven, twelve, almost twelve. But I mean, say, if this team being able to work together, I think they're trying, they know each other now, right? And this guy is trying to conquer everything now. <laughs> but his name is The Visitor. <laughs> I don't know how he... But 
No, the leader they are, the more they have this kind of want to be in the group, conquering the group. But our kids must be able to work together always. Okay? So I feel like they're like loving each other now, but because I mean, I think Josh was one week away. I think that's the best medicine. Vacation, one week. 일주일 오지 마. 알았어? 교회 오지 마. 진짜? Okay. 하여튼, we need to be always flexible with them, okay? So our worship, as I told you in Fridays to our parents, you need to really let them know what is kingdom of God in a specific way. Okay? All right. He brought the big party. Let's pray and we finish with the parent message, okay? Uh, God, thank you for giving us our kids. Let them grow in the gospel and let us be used for this ministry. Thank you, God, and we pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen.